Welcome back to another video where I show you what I eat in a day as a 180cm tall, 120 kilogram guy, or for the Americans, about 5'11", 270 pounds. Uh, I will show everything I eat except for my fruit because uh, I have two or three pieces of fruit a day. For this week, I just have a bunch of apples and some mandarin oranges. I'm not going to show you that every single time because that gets pretty boring. Uh, I also don't show what I drink because that's usually plain old water or uh, tea without sugar or the occasional sugar-free soda. Uh, if I do have anything with sugar or other kind of calories in it, I will show you. Um, uh, yeah, you won't see uh, breakfast because I don't eat it. Not a big breakfast person, never been. So lunches and dinners. Uh, lunch is generally low carb, keto friendly because I had to cut carbs because I'm diabetic and the easiest way I found to do that was to just cut them from lunch uh, except on the weekend when I have my cheat days because bread is easy and really good and uh, yeah I just have that as on my cheat days then I just have regular uh, uh, dinners. I will show snacks which will probably be some chocolate because I have two bars of chocolate in a week one usually on Saturday and one on Sunday because those are my cheat days and uh, yeah, if I have any other snacks, I will of course show you as well. Um, I think we got all of that out of the way. Uh, I'm a pretty active guy and a big guy, so if my portion seems big, that's because I'm a big guy. I do about uh, a minimum of 10,000 steps every day. My average is closer to 12,000. And actually I should be hitting 20 million steps since I started track it, uh, tracking uh, probably next week, so. But yeah, I do everything on foot or by bicycle, so I do get a lot of uh, exercise in. And um, yeah, I think that's everything out of the way. So let's just get started with lunch on Sunday. So we'll start with lunch on Sunday. That's just some uh, multi-grain rolls with some ham, some cucumber, some lettuce, and some mustardy mayo. And as per usual, while I'm editing this Sunday prep day video, I'm going to have a bar of chocolate. For dinner on Sunday, I roasted a bunch of different vegetables like baby potatoes, purple, yellow, and orange carrots, some uh, parsnips, and some celery roots. And I have some roasted ham on the side. For lunch on Monday, Meatless Monday, I made some uh, homemade tomato soup that I'm going to bring to work with me. For dinner on Meatless Monday, I'm having some brown rice with some vegan chickpea curry. Lunch for Tuesday, some leftover ham that I roasted, and some uh, Romanesco. I'm a bit hungry, so for a snack, I got some beef jerky to keep it uh, low-cal and especially low-carb. Dinner for Taco Tuesday is some chicken quesadillas with some homemade roasted salsa. For lunch on Wednesday, I'm having some Brussels sprouts with some bacon and some onions. For dinner on Wednesday, I made a tahine with uh, chicken and lots of veggies and a harissa sauce and I served that over some uh, whole wheat uh, couscous with parsley. For lunch on Thursday I made some keto chicken nuggets using almond flour and I just made those in the ninja foodie. I have some green beans on the side and I made a quick uh, peri peri mayo. Dinner on Thursday is some lime cilantro rice with some chicken in that uh, roasted salsa that I made the other day. For lunch on Fish Friday, I'm having a low-carb stir-fry with some salmon, and uh, instead of regular rice, I'm using what they call zero-carb rice, which is made from konyaku. For dinner on Fish Friday, I'm having some fish tacos with some uh, mayo and some sriracha. Movie night tonight, I'm going to watch some kind of Christmas movie. I haven't decided which one yet, but uh, I was craving a snack, so I got these uh, sausage things. And uh, I think that's the last thing for this video. And there we go, that was everything I ate this week. So um, I tried to do this about once a month. Sometimes it's short videos like this where I just show you the finished result. Sometimes I show you everything, uh, how I actually prepare it. Kind of depends on how much time I have to edit during the week. Um, but yeah, if you like this kind of content, uh, let me know and I'll try to do it more regularly. And uh, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching. Until next time, bye for now.